students in this session you are going to learn chapter 7 python functions so content of the session is lambda function what is return statement what is recursive function as you know types of functions or user defined functions built in functions lambda recursion so you have learned user defined built in and the function arguments types now you are going to learn what is lambda what is recursion what is lambda in python anonymous function is a function that is defined without a name while normal functions are defined using the def keyword in python anonymous functions are defined using the lambda keyword hence anonymous functions are also called as lambda functions let's see this with an example so what's the syntax first of all we have to say it as lambda followed by arguments colon expression so sum equal to lambda arguments are argument 1 comma argument 2 colon expression is summation of the two values see the example sum equal to lambda so instead of def we are using the keyword lambda and arguments are given directly near this colon then the function that means the process expression sum of the two values here the function sum here the name function name uh, is called with the variable of sum 30 comma 40 then minus 30 comma 40 so it is 30 plus 40 70 minus 30 plus 40 so it is 10 here we can say it is minus also instead of we'll say multiplication so 30 into 40 1200 30 into 40 but it is a minus symbol so minus 1200 so lambda function is formed with the keyword lambda arguments colon expression clear children Then return statement. Return statement causes a function to exit and returns a value to its caller. Any number of return statements are allowed in a function definition, but only one of them is executed at runtime. Syntax return expression list. We'll see the example. See the example here. Diff username one parameter. Here the definition is if n is greater than or equal to 0 return because uh, this is for absolute value else it is minus n so enter a number this is to get a value from the user print user define abs of x asking a number will give one number is 87 so as it is a positive number, it is giving absolutely like this. If we give a negative number as it will change the negative number to positive and it is giving. So minus into minus again it is plus. Here what you understood is return n. Normally return is the end of the line but if we can ask a value to print to the called place so return n means it return the value of n to the place where the function is called so here the function is called so in this line it is printing the value so you learned what is lambda and what is return statement now what is recursion function? When a function calls itself is known as recursion. It's an important concept in Python. 
Surely you will get a question from this concept. Regression works like loop, but sometimes it makes more sense to use regression than loop. You can convert any loop to regression. Simply, a function calls itself is known as regression. We will see the example. See the function. The fact of n. Print start. If n is equal to equal to 0, return 1. This is the program for factorial value. So as you know, factorial starts from 1. 1 factorial means it is 1. That is 0 factorial is 1. Then if it is 5 factorial, it has to multiply 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 into 5. That is 5 factorial. Am I right? So here we are saying if the given value is 0, simply return 1 or else go for the process. Can you see here? n into fact of n minus 1. What is n here? First, the n is if it is not 0, for example, if it is a 5, then it is 5. 5 into n minus 1. n minus 1 means 5 minus 1, 4. Again, the function is called. It will come down. Again, it will check 4. 4 is not equal to 0. Then it go for 4 into, already it is 5. 5 into 4 into n minus 1 is 3. We will see it will be very interesting. First, I will get the output for fact of 0. So, fact of 0. It's 0 is passed here. Print start. So, start is given. If n equal to equal to 0. Yes, it is 0. So, return 1. 1 is returned. So, it is come out of the part. It didn't go for the else part. So, 1 start. Is it clear? Now, we are going to call this fact of 5. See here. Fact of 0, start 1. Another fact of 5. Can you see how many start it is having? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and it is 20. 120. So 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 into 5 it is 120. I will explain what happens in this. So this fact n minus 1 is called this much of time. So a function is called by itself is called recursion. So can you see this how many times the now is executed 1, 2, 3, 2, 5. So it is fact of 5. This function is called by itself. This else part is executed 5 times. If it is 4. Four times executed. So Regression function means a function calls itself. I hope you understood this concept. So you learnt lambda, return statement and regression function. Thank you. Have a good day.